10 News Weather Authority, always watching and tracking for you from the JES Weather Center. Good morning, everybody. I'm meteorologist Edward Shaw. Take a look outside. We got pretty gorgeous skies right now over Martinsville and Withville. Little cloudier in Roanoke, and we still have that fog in Blacksburg and parts of the New River Valley. So you have a morning commute this morning. Just keep that in mind if you're down there in Blacksburg going on 460. Today, we could see showers and storms later throughout the afternoon. Pretty moderate wind, 88 degrees today. Overall, going to be a pretty typical summer day in terms of temperatures and rain. 88 degrees in Roanoke, 84 in Rocky Mount, 86 in Martinsville, 88 in Danville, 83 in Blacksburg. So overall, some pretty typical summertime temperatures. Now, timing everything out with you for the rain with Futurecast, you see we have these winds that are really going to bring in this Gulf moisture, which is why we have so much rain, why we've had so much rain over the last few days. These tor this torrential rainfall is going to continue the risk for localized flash flooding in some areas that where some cells could produce quite a bit of rain. A lot of morning sunshine is going to fuel storm development later on in the afternoon and evening. So when we looked at the sky cam, you could see a few sunshine areas there here and there. That is really going to fuel energy for storms later on in the day. Tomorrow, the rain and shower risk returns with the next wave of showers and storms as that front really just lingers over our area. And the flash flood risk continues as well, just due to the fact we're going to have a lot of rain over the next few days, some of which could occur in a very short period of time. Looking at flood risk, Weather Prediction Center has put us under a slight flood risk for parts of our area. And you can see this is really just to tell where all the moisture is as it comes up through the Gulf of Mexico and comes into our area. So overall, just the flood risk in the area is going to be something to monitor, especially in urbanized areas and on roads, as some cells could produce nearly two to four inches of rain per hour in some areas. Temperatures pretty typical for this time of year. Roanoke, Blacksburg, Lynchburg, and Danville, all about where they should be for this time of year, maybe a degree or two warmer. But ultimately, pretty straightforward day. Uh, just typical summertime temperatures, quite a bit of rain. Rain chances taper off, though, Friday and into the weekend, and that cold front moving through the area is going to drop the humidity, meaning we could see a pretty nice weekend ahead. Now, taking a look today for our neck of the woods, have that flood risk still within the area as this line of showers and storms passes through. Could see a few coastal showers along the Outer Banks and coastal Carolina and Virginia Beach, and then a pretty sunny start to, to the central part of the state, just in parts of Richmond and central Virginia. Taking a look at your three-day forecast, Again, 6% chance of rain today, 70% chance on Wednesday, and running temperatures in the mid-80s for most of the week.